Hey, what's up, YouTube? What's going on? Listen, we're going to get right into it. Dijon Paul, you know what I'm saying? There's a little bit of news, some real exciting news. Is right now. It's, it's actually more like a rumor. I'm not going to say news. It's a rumor because we have no confirmation of it. Possibility that Dijon Paul got I know jumper, you know what I'm saying? I'm not going to say the word, but it's possible that Dijon Paul got hit with a projectile out of, out of a firearm. I know jumper don't exactly know who did it or what was the cause, but somebody does. And it's AD. AD talks about it a little bit here. Let's get right into it. Start the clip up, man. Sorry for any kind of background noise I got to deal with right now, man. It's a, it's a, it's an active day here at the lab. It's an active Dijon, day. Man. Oh shit. What, what's going on? Get right into it. Cause I just saw a picture right here. I just saw a picture now where he on a crutch walking around right now. So he didn't got where he need a crutch. That's crazy. Oh man. He done, he done got shot where he need a crutch. I, I saw a picture of him on a crutch today. You saw that picture? I seen the picture. I'm like, damn. They say he removed his name out of there and all that. Yeah. So, you know. What's your thoughts on that? What's going on? I mean, we ain't got to say who did it, what, what you know, like who yeah, did yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. But what's your thoughts on that? We don't got to say who did it or what you know. Crazy. Um, I knew eventually. That boy finna get paid. He definitely. They're going to change that name. He uh, for sure going to get paid. They're going to change that channel name. They changed the title of this video, too, because this video was definitely titled something different an hour and a half ago. An hour and a half ago, they were definitely a lot more clickbaity with this title. The title of their video was AD Knows Who Shot Dijon Paul. Hey, that's going to be the report card channel. Just, <laughs> just speaking facts, that was the title of the video. Hey, that's a, oh, that's a, if that really happened at the workplace, that's an easy W. You could take every penny and cent from that if that happened at the workplace. That's well, an easy W. But I'm hearing it did happen at the workplace. It's an easy W. Better hope it did. A lot of insights say, uh, it, yeah. Better hope it did. Because when I first heard about it, I was like. Who do they know that's inside No Jumper? Let's see. They got two people. They got Gordy and Brick that they know or that AD knows. They also know Flacco. I don't know of anyone else. They may know Bossa, have contact with Bossa, but I don't think Bossa's doing that. So they've got three really big sources there that they know. I mean, they know Sharp and have contacts with Sharp, but to my knowledge, Sharp wouldn't be the type to leak this. And I don't think, I, don't, I just don't, I don't see that being the case. He's already stood, you know, with no jumper in other moments. So let's get back to this. I was like, this. But just think about that. He had, they do have three people that could send them that: Gordy, Brick, and Flocka. Hey, John, hit me up. I, we can call a truce if you got a problem with me. But I got a lawyer. Psych, they have one more very, very insightful person, but they don't, they're not at no jumper. This person that they know is a family member of Dijon Paul, and that is Auntie. They know Auntie. Auntie is Dijon Paul's cousin as well. If I'm not mistaken, they know the security guard who's been rumored to be a possible person who, you know, was the, was the, the one who might have let off the, you know, the firearm on, uh, on, on accident, you know, had that, who, the person who had the accidental discharge. Now, if that's the case and it was the security, they know him too. That's five people, a one, three people that work there, one security guard who also works there, and a family member of Flacco that they're very, I'm a family member of Dijon Paul who they're very cool with. Lawyer that will milk for every thing. I just need 20%. I just need 20%. Now, give me 10%. I got a lawyer that will take the house, the you know, cars, the, everything for me. The company? Everything. Bro, everything, everything will be in your name, brother. I just give me 10%. 10%. 10% you could have it. That, hey. When I heard that, I said, wow. Damn. Wow. Yeah, that's crazy. That's, What's the chances that's... of something like that happening? I don't know, man. That's wild. I I, I know everybody was like, I don't listen, man, because at this point, everybody be doing all this fake content shit, and it's like, everybody was like, are, are, is that fake? Is that, are they doing content? Are they blah, blah, blah? And I'm like, I don't know. But I'm like, see the nigga walk around with a crutch in real life, in real time? I don't think that's content. Not even point. that. A couple of a couple of uh, credible people confirmed it. So I was like, oh shit. Walking around with a crutch is like super confirmation. Like who's gonna fake that in real life? <laughs> sure for you sure. Know what I'm saying? Uh yeah, man, that's crazy. That's crazy, you know? And it make it worse that it's Dijon. That's crazy. Cause he don't have no street code he has to abide by. At all. He's homosexual. Oh man. Now they just breached on something. I don't think the gay thing has anything to do with Deshaun Paul being possibly shot here, but they, well, there has been a rumor that it was a possibility that it was a family member. 
auntie would know that, but if it was a family member and that there was some relation to the possibility of like, an, you know, being an angry reaction to him being outed as gay and being played with on social media or just being gay in general and outed and whatever. But regardless, he's been clearly injured in some case he's tweeted out that you know thank god he's he's still alive and different things like that those aren't things that just happen in you know some form of a legal suit so definitely some form of physical thing that's happened to him he shot me because i was gay yep i'm saying all that oh no that's wild (laughs) he does have a crazy case that's wild bro dejan about to own no jumper yeah man um that's gonna be a crazy one uh, to see what unfolds there because uh yeah man at the workplace whoo there's so many laws and you can get some chili out of that. Hey, when I see where, where's this, when super, I see super this chili. picture today, I was like, Do y'all oh, think Dejan Paul will be suing No Jumper if that is the case? That. If there if there is mm-hmm. if there is room for him to sue, do you think he goes that route or do you think he, he plays his cards with Adam and tries to finesse Adam into, you know, giving him more position? I think he'll sue. I mean if there's likelihood or if there's grounds to sue, he's gonna do that. And Adam's insured as a business, I'm sure, so he's gonna just sue the insurance, not Adam as a whole. So, this could get real lucrative for Dijon. Let me know what y'all would do. Would you sue your employer? Remember what they said. Dijon has no no street ties or street cred, so he can go full civilian. Yeah, he can get regular talk. Nah, this is, this is interesting. I've I seen clips. I never, Here you go. You know, I never tapped out over there. Y'all, y'all are hilarious. <laughs> Yeah, over there with the crutch, bro. He look happy as hell, too. Yeah, you about to get that check, nigga. You feel me? He about to get that store on Melrose. He about to get the building over there. He about to get he about to get broke off. If that if that's what happens. So, like, realistically, how much do you think he can he can he can get? I'm asking for a hundred million, none less. Hundred million. I'm asking for it. Now yeah. you gonna you got to meet me somewhere, bitch. I almost lost Dragon, my life. Can... What would you guys ask for if you got hypothetically popped at your workplace? Or fatally, or you know, or 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 possibly fatally injured. You know what I'm saying? You you got injured in a way that could have killed you, in a way that risked your life. How would you? How would you go about it with your employer? What kind of a what amount of money would you ask for? Y'all, let me know down below. If you get popped at the workplace, nigga, how much you suing for? You gotta ask for the most. At work. At work. I want everything. Everything. <laughs> the fuck you mean, nigga? I, I could have lost my life, nigga. I could have lost my life coming to work for you. He tweeted that too. He almost lost his life. I said, listen, you're going to a workplace where you are an employee and nigga, you almost get killed while at work by another employee or whatever. Like, nigga. I'm- hey, there it is right there. Remember what I said, the title of the videos before like an hour ago said AD knows who shot Dejal Paul. That's all I'm saying. That's the title of the video. I'm not saying AD does know. I'm just saying that that was the title of the video. If you know how to use YouTube, you can figure that out. Or if you're not used to the internet, you can go find that uh, that old title. But, hey, y'all comment down below. Let me know what you're doing in this type of situation. Do you think Jean Paul did get uh, possibly popped at, at No Jumper? And if so, like I said, w- not only what would you do in that situation, but what do you think is going to happen with this? Do you think he's going to go the route of suing Adam, or do you think he'll try to do some more diplomatic or, or you know, take a more diplomatic or po- po- political approach to it? You know what I mean? More blue-collar approach and kind of try to do business with Adam in a different way and, and use that as leverage. I'm interested to see what you guys think. Like, comment, subscribe, turn on the notifications. I'll see y'all in the next video.